Hey guys, Nonkel Rouget here from Belgium. Well, today I decided to make some colloidal silver because mine was empty, the bowl, so, well, I decided to make some more. And uh, while making it, I decided to make a video on how I do it and whatever. Might be interesting for you, might be not, who knows. Alright, so here's my old school battery charger, as I, as I told you in my other video. And I mean, it's really old school. Check it out, it's made in West Germany. That it's that old. <laughs> so we've got here a bowl um, with demineralized water. A really, really amateuristic system for holding two electrodes. Let me focus on that. You can see it inside the water there. But the crocodile clamps do not touch the water. Now, currently, it's running. So if I shed some light on the water, you can see it's kind of lo kind of looks disgusting, you know. But it's because uh, I just taken off this uh, cloth uh, for the purpose of making this video. Normally I just put it in a dark place. So that's it. And uh, how I do it, just run two wires, as you can see here. It's got one clamped here and one in here. But uh, I just wrapped it inside so they don't shor short circuit. That would suck because uh, the whole uh, battery charger would be broken. Alright, so this is uh, how I do, uh, make colloidal silver. I would leave it for about maybe five, six hours because I don't want that strong one as last time because it came out really bitter and didn't taste it that good anyway. So, But it healed fantastically. It was very concentrated. Okay, guys, this is basically it. If you got any questions, feel free to ask them. This is Nonkel Roger from Belgium. Bye-bye.